Hey, hey we're, we're Citizen, Citizen Way. Way. And you're watching 117 TV. I'm Jennifer Vickery and so fortunate today to be with the guys from Citizen Way. So nice to see you. Yeah, yeah. You guys have been busy on tour and promoting a couple different great songs out there, including Should Have Been Me, which I love. It should have been me, it should have been us, should have been there hanging on a cross. All of this shame, all of these scars, should have been stains that were never washed cool story behind that isn't there yes uh, that one in particular I felt like it was a song it was just I could pluck out of the air because this kid at the end of the camp uh, a week I was leading worship at we just asked him what he learned and we had just gone through the stations of the cross an entire crash course in the whole Bible and he's like you know I learned that it should have been me and literally right away this song came and I sang it for him about 27 minutes later so I always feel like I was just part of what God was already doing that is really, really cool and so profound for a, a youngster yeah. participating in a, ca a camp to have that depth that turned into that. And then look how that, does he know the story behind the song and how it's touching so many lives? That's so cool. I've been trying to find him on Facebook for a long time. I found his youth pastor, oh. you know, but uh, he said, I don't think I loved it, he was 13, you're right, it was profound because he understood that we were, Jesus stepped in and paid our debt for us, you know. I'm like, this kid got it, man. I thought it was pretty cool. I've, I'm still trying to find him. His name's Morgan. He lives in Maryland. So hopefully. <laughs> so to Morgan out there, wow, yeah. look what you've done or, or God has done through you. That's pretty cool, pretty cool. So um, the, the album is Love is the Evidence that's out there and available. It came out this spring. And then the new single, let's talk about that one, Nothing Ever Could Separate Us. the title alone there. Um, tell us a little bit about that, how that song came to be. Well, that one really comes out of Romans chapter 8. You know, uh, there's nothing in all of creation that can separate us from the love of God that we have in Christ Jesus. So you put that with some loud rock and roll behind it, turn it up to 11, and you got a good song. Uh, because it's scripture, you know, you let God's word kind of speak for itself. So for us, that was one that we've loved playing. The crowds love singing it with us. It's God's truth, and that goes a long way. Okay, so let's let's back up a little bit here so we can tell people more about how this band came to be. So Citizen Way, it's two sets of brothers. If you can't tell, you might could match them up here a little bit. But tell me about how you guys met and uh, how you formed Citizen Way. Well, I, I joined the, I'm more of a, like a rookie in the band, so to speak. I joined about three years ago. Um, we used to be a band called The Least of These. Okay. That band was around for about eight or nine years. Um, but same type of music, same yes, genre. Yes, yes, just band. just more of a name change. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, but these three met in college, actually, at uh, Judson University down by Chicago. Yeah. So. So you guys were attending school together at Judson. Yeah. Yeah, and didn't know each other before, but had that common link of music, or you did. <laughs> you had to know him. You grew up together, right? <laughs> I met Ben my senior year in college. He was a freshman, I believe. Right? Is that what I think it's about? Right? Yep. I think roughly. And then we, I was doing a record and recruited these guys to play on it, and we've been playing ever since. Wow, so cool. And so you've been doing lots of touring to get the music out there. Just finished with Big Daddy Weave and Chris August. I know that had to be a lot of fun. Too. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. Year, cool. Yeah, and then this uh, fall you'll go back out. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, we're hitting the road with uh, Sank This Real is headlining a tour, and they asked us to join them on tour this fall. We're really excited to be a part of that. Gonna be good. Very, very good lineup there. So, well, congratulations on all the success. Love, love the music, and uh, I know you've got a big, busy summer of touring ahead as well before you gear up for the big one with Sanctus Real coming up this fall. And so, everybody can find out more about you and get the music at citizenway.com. Citizenwaymusic.com. Yes, let's make sure we know that citizenwaymusic.com. Okay. All right. Thanks, guys. We appreciate you spending time with us. Can't feel you. 